Welcome, in this video we will see PDF ID tool which is a forensics tool in Kalinux. This tool is not a PDF parser but it will scan a file to look for a certain PDF keywords allowing you to identify PDF documents that contain JavaScript or execute an action when opened. PDF ID will also handle name obfuscation. The idea is to use this tool first to track PDF documents and then analyze a suspicious one with my PDF parser. An important design criteria for this program is simplicity. Parsing a PDF document completely requires a very complex program and hence it is bound to contain many bugs to add the risk of getting exploited. PDF ID will scan a PDF document for a given list of string and count the occurrence of each word. That is object, end of objects, stream, and stream, x reference, trailer, start x reference, page, encryption, javascript, open action, rich media, launch, xfa, and so on. Almost every PDF document will contain the first seven words, that is object through start x reference, and to lesser extent stream and end stream. The page gives an indication of number of pages in PDF document. Most malicious PDF document have only one page. Encrypt indicates that the PDF document has DRM or needs a password to be read. Object STM counts the number of object streams. An object stream is a stream object that contain other objects and can therefore be used to obfuscate objects. JS and JavaScript indicate that the PDF document contains JavaScript. Almost all malicious PDF documents that are found in the wild contain JavaScript. To exploit JavaScript vulnerability or to execute a heap spray. And of course, you can also find JavaScript in PDF documents without malicious intent. Double E and open action indicate an automatic action to be performed when the page or document is viewed. All malicious PDF documents with JavaScript I have seen in the wild had an automatic action to launch JavaScript without user interaction. The combination of automatic action and JavaScript makes a PDF document very suspicious. JBIG2 decode indicates if the PDF document uses JBIG2 compression. This is not necessarily indication of malicious PDF document but requires further investigation. Rich media is for embedded flash. Launch counts launch action. XFA is for XML forms architecture. A number that appears between parentheses of the counter represents the number of obfuscated occurrence. Let's do some practical. Let's open up the terminal and type PDF ID. Here you can see that the basic syntax of PDF ID tool, PDF ID options, PDF file, zip file, URL, at the rate file. Options for PDF ID tool. That is hyphen hyphen version shows program version number and exit. Hyphen H shows this is help message and exit. Hyphen S scan the given directory. Hyphen E display all the names. Hyphen E display extra data like dates. Hyphen F for the scan of the file even without proper PDF header. And so on. Let's scan the desktop directory using hyphen S option. So type PDF ID space hyphen S root desktop. You can see that scanning the PDF files in desktop directory and welcome.pdf file is found. Now let's analyze the welcome.pdf file. Type PDF ID root desktop welcome.pdf. Here you can see that object and end object number of object stream is 918. Stream and end stream is 767 and so on. Using hyphen hyphen version option, we can see the version of the tool. So type PDF ID space hyphen hyphen version. Here you can see that PDF ID version 0 
So that's it in this video on PDF ID package, which is a forensic tool in Kalinux. Thank you for watching this video.